welcome to the vlog again it's been a long time <laughs> June morning ride to Tagatai or Laguna I don't know yet let's see what the expressway will take me very long time so long since I actually went on a solo ride like this almost a year let's enjoy it let's find some good food actually have some expressway ride on a 1 to 5 I need to put it out the only thing when I'm on the way back is the audio there's an issue with audio but I got the first part of this you gotta taste a little bit of the struggle of riding a 1 to 5 on an expressway really 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 I'll tell you the truth I hope it doesn't happen in the Philippines because I was struggling so much with the 1 to 5 in France when I went on the expressway such a struggle honestly not recommended at all you'll see the vlog you will see some truck was passing by me it was a disaster 300 will do you know if you have an x max you can go an expressway but one to five 150 nah no way it's gonna take me a while It's busy. See how many trucks? That is dangerous, actually. Can we go? Or can we go? Or can we go? Not go. Can we not go? Not go. It's dangerous, I tell you. Cannot be very stupid today. Eh? Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Safe. Hello. You know. If one break down now, everyone is crashing, so you have to think twice, no? Cannot be so stupid on the expressway, you know, you have to be a bit, uh, uh, how do you call this, how do you call this, um, I forget the name. You have to ride safe. You cannot be a stupid influencer, you know what I mean? Stupid influencer! Riding fast on expressway and doesn't have the balls to do it on a track. Haha. <laughs> Boom! Video <VHL> slap. Boom! <laughs> I feel good today, I feel good. Back on the vlog. Feel good to to give a few video slap here and there. My god, it's gonna be long as fuck. If I went by Cavite on not, not on the expressway. It would have probably be there already than on the expressway busy like this. Oh and oh helmet. There's many now I was selling helmet. Oh, all they have to say is oh and oh oh X oh yeah good luck guys some when you actually know if it's gonna move or no you know like brand of helmet when i started i started with kyt i tried hjc i tried spider i think yeah spider a few spider a few hjc then i just focused on kyt because really in my area it was really what's moving or not only you know what i mean only kyt kyt moto yss that was the top three that's really moving, you know. Still saying now. Hey, wait, you move two ways. Sometimes I see 
people having a shop with all those brain or special brain and I'm like for sure this one is not moving for sure you are not selling it SRP for sure you must struggle to give this content to do every day because I know some of the brand and I talk to people and I'm like you know it's not moving it's really slow moving some of them before many people after during pandemic right many people started handmade business motorcycle business now many of them are closed it's not it's not easy because there's such there was a high demand before, there's still high demand now with helmet and things like that, you know, motorcycle shop. But there's such a high competition. Like there's such a huge competition that sometimes you know people don't doesn't fair fight uh, the, the, doesn't fight fair, you know what I mean? They, they will give you huge discounts to make sure they will sell more than the guy next door. Anyhow, getting the expressway. My first time actually coming with to Tagata with expressway is quite nice. It's quite nice. I have to say, expressway is really freedom to go wherever you want, very very fast. Probably spend 25 minutes on the expressway only. So it's really freedom to go wherever you want. If I want to go on cl at Clark on a track or Batangas, just get the Duke Expressway. I go on a track with the bike. I come back again. Use and abuse. Use and abuse. Pedal still strong, you know. This one I haven't have any problem with it. It's like eleven thousand two hundred almost. And I haven't got any problem. I have it at 7,000, so I make free 4,000. Oh, only 4,000 kilometer in over a year. This is really the bike that I take on the weekend, you know. My daddy is still on the CB150, so my daddy is still the Honda. Really, I enjoy the Honda because it's not hot. The Honda is not hot. It's gas consumption very, very good. It's like. 40 per liter or 42 this one it see today on expo is 24 24 per liter so if i use this every day i would use like 15 liter uh, 15 kilometer more than per liter you know it's quite expensive especially gas now that was this is so hot you know for city riding it's not so good um it does the job if you want to go to point A to point B, it does a good job, it's fast, but it's not comfortable as, you know, smaller bike, smaller CC is much better. That's why I keep my own, my own 150 because it, it's really cheap to change the oil and things like that. And I want to do all the service myself. This one, I don't do the change of oil, I don't want to struggle to take off the thing, then this is like free drain. Forget about it. I bring to the garage, and this because I don't ride so much, you know, I can use. I can just service once in a while. Actually, the modification on this change the mirror, the pipe, tapos, the muffler, not the pipe, tapos. I changed the tire to purely Diablo because the one I had early was very very bad. Tapos 300V. I use 300V on it. You get much more power, much it's much smooth compared to regular oil. 300V really make the difference. I don't mind uh, spending money on this. It's expensive. Don't get me wrong. It's like one five a bottle or something like that. SRP. Pedal. It does really a big difference on your bike. So. You and the good little girl toy. I wanted to do the whole loop at first. I said, Oh, I'm gonna go to Tagata. I do the whole loop. Uh, the tall lake, the lake loop, no? 
bad or when I started to have a look it was like 150 kilometer I was like fuck me 750 to come here 170 that was coming back uh, never mind I'm just gonna eat somewhere nice spend the money in food instead of gas spend all the money in food enjoy Antonio breakfast probably one of the best one of the best um, honestly one of the best western restaurant in Tagatai was great Antonio breakfast as usual supplies very good food honestly they're actually opening one in Manila very soon Antonio breakfast um, fine dining Antonio fine dining now they open but they're opening Antonio breakfast and a few of Antonio's restaurant Mecomanera Baguio, Boracay, uh, maybe Bohol, I'm not sure. But we're opening a few now. Always great food. Always, always great food.